water guns. You were surprised. So you get to the screen a lot. So I'm going down one. Come on. I have no idea. Can't just go for a man, I guess. Yeah, I'm Jeff Cucciara and I'm helping out the arcade event at the library today. We set up a bunch of consoles and various other things from years ago, sometimes even 30 years, sometimes 40 years old. And we just let the general public come in and play anything they want. Yeah, the, the tournament series we do. I use tournament really loosely. It's just a fun thing. We just let kids come. It's a free tournament. And allow it to have a sense of competitive nature in a Smash Brothers, which is like a fighting game, Nintendo characters. And they have fun doing it. We just loop them all together in the big groups, and then they go at it, and we have a winner at the end. Um, we have a old Pong system from 1997. That, that's not when Pong came out. That's like one I brought. There are like 50 Pong cons. I brought one of them. People like playing that. I have this thing called a Vectrex here, which is like this weird 80s thing that has vector graphics on it, which is the, the only system to display vector graphics. Um, and I bring games like a Super Nintendo, like Super Mario World and stuff like that. And I even bring um, older games, but they're not like too old, like 10 or 15 years ago, like GameCube games, like people my age or a bit younger remember playing Mario Kart on it, so they like playing those games too. They're old, but they're not, you know, asteroids. But yet, I know, sometimes 100 people throughout the entire day, sometimes 200, some in that mix. It's not always so crowded, you can't move in there, obviously. It's a pretty big room. But during the term, it's typically when it's the most crowded, because you have the parents watching their kids play. Galaxy and Space Fairs are pretty popular in 2000. A lot of adults play that, too, which is great. I like when the adults are just playing the games they remembered growing up or playing them with their kids. That's always the best part of this. A music video game where basically you hit the drum to the beat and you have to match it with the it's color coordinated by how you hit it it has like it has Jackson 5 Queen and then it has other different artists and it has, yeah, classical music as well uh, I've only played it a month ago and I lost it easy <laughs> catchy simple to play it's basically anybody can play this, and I think it's also just my love for music as well. I am Kaden Hartzell. I live in the um, Chatham Town. I live in the Chatham Borough. I'm here to play in the um, Super Smash Bros. tournament, and uh, because I feel like I'm able to actually play really well. I like it because it's more of like it's most of my favorite characters all fighting in one, and it's just really fun to play and watch. It is pretty hard when you com when you compare it to like other games, but once you get into like once you get the the controls down and everything, it becomes really fun.